Hey guys, you know who this is and you are at my house because I need a new backyard. So, Mrs. Yao has decided to take it upon herself and your class to redesign my backyard. Okay, so should we, you want to take us on a little tour? Sure. What and this is the awesome, awesome little baby girl here. Can you say hi, Addie? Hi. Say hi. I have a huge side yard over here. Not huge, but kind of huge. Yep. So there's and it's all there. concrete. It's all concrete. Now, are you willing to... It get rid. Do you want to just keep the concrete? I'm undecided. Undecided. We can get rid of concrete. We can leave it. It's really expensive to lay the concrete, and so now that it's here and it's clean, I kind of want to plan around it. But I'm willing to remove some pieces of it. Okay. Um. Then the part you're standing on is a pad, mm -hmm. so there is electrical running through it. So like, if we wanted to do a hot tub, which I want a hot tub, this would be one location. That okay. Put a hot tub in. But this could also be outdoor kitchen space as well. Okay. Um, and then there's a big pile of dirt back here. Yep. Yeah, this should all. This is all going to be taken out, and I don't know exactly if this is all going to be grass. Um, we've talked about this being grass area. We've also talked about some decking, maybe, to get break up the concrete to do more like a wood deck, and then grass. Um, but you do want grass rather, or are you interested in something that's more? drought resistant I want to be as drought resistant and drought friendly as possible but we also have two dogs so they need some grass to run on and I want some grass for her it doesn't all have to be grass though okay okay um, all right and then looking up we see these you told me about these these are two huge scoreboards from Granada High School so the on the other side of this fence is Granada's track um, and the kids can see that when they go online to Google to Maps, uh, Google Maps, they'll be able to see those. I would say it would be a huge bonus to anyone who came up with a design that when we're either sitting in our house looking out or when we're out here hanging out with friends that we are distracted from the scoreboards or somehow they're blocked or covered. Right. Distracted or blocked mm -hmm. altogether. Okay. And then you can see just from looking around, there's no shade back here. Right. Um, so we've, we're, you know, we want some kind of shade structure. I don't know what that looks like or how much we need. Okay. Um, we've thought about doing one huge pergola, like from that the dining room window, that second window over to like the edge of the house is the second window so I, I'm looking at the at the the glass doors here that's and then our living room so that goes into our living room okay and then that's our dining room oh, okay and then what's this third window the third window is our bedroom we okay. actually also talked about doing French doors out so taking that window out and having those be French doors that open into okay. the backyard okay okay all right so let's go over and take a look at uh, the side yard over here where are you going, Annie? Can you say hi? <laughs> so then on this side, we have another huge, this is the huge side yard. So this is where we're keeping, we're working on the house. This is all of our construction stuff. This we want to be a garden. A garden, like a raised garden? Yeah, we're thinking raised garden boxes. <clears throat> I want it to be really cool. Like I want to walk back here and be like, whoa, that's amazing. I also want a chicken coop. Oh, mm -hmm. like Mrs. Taylor, we're gonna have chickens back here. Very cool. So um, we're gonna have chicken play dates. She's gonna bring her chickens, and we're gonna play with all the chickens. <laughs> That's mm -hmm. fun. Yeah. So okay, um, if it's gonna be a raised garden, can that be done? I guess the kids can find this out, but that can either needs to be done on the current concrete, or um, some of the concrete will have to be taken out. Mm -hmm. So if any of the concrete gets taken out, it's probably gonna be in this area, right? Yeah, I could see that happening. I, I think if you do garden boxes that are deep enough, most, most, um, and I want it to all obviously be edible, so most step, most things can grow, but I'm not sure exactly the depth they would need to be. So this will be the garden and the chicken coop. Mm-hmm. And you, in this project, they could design a chicken coop. Oh, yeah, that's true. Definitely. So, and then the, the fence is kind of nice to have here to keep it 
um, yeah. cordoned off from the rest so of the. Yeah, that's separate. Okay, very cool. All right, so, and shade. I would love water feature. Mm. Outdoor kitchen. It's got to have outdoor kitchen. So it's got to have like an outdoor. I want a lounge area, and then I want an eating area and an outdoor kitchen. There's a lot of potential here. Mm -hmm. Water feature, fire feature. Yeah. What do you think? Say, I need a swing. I like to swing. You want to go on a swing? I, okay. <gasps> do you but blow kisses? Hey. No, you're not gonna blow kisses. <laughs> but Addie definitely needs a swing set of some kind. Okay. And that should probably be over the, if there was going to be grass, I would imagine that would need to be over the grass. Or, or you... Like a fort with a swing. Ooh. Ooh, a fort with a swing. She a fort. She wants to be able to hide from me. Oh, and cool. Swing. Or you could put like some, maybe some, um, uh, something soft yeah. underneath, you know, and maybe that, that would be a good use of this area over here, too. So one other thing that my husband bothers him more than it bothers me. When we sit in our couch, we're facing this way because our TV's on that wall. And he looks out this window and he sees their fence. And okay. out the kitchen window and he sees their fence. <laughs> and he says that he would love to have look outside and have that be something other than other than a fence. fence. Okay. Which is interesting to me. I don't know what to do with that whole area. Okay, so I think we have some good ideas here. Thank you very much. Thanks, guys. And I'm going to have to get my kids started on this. Can you say thank you? Okay, or not. You're not going to you're not going to show your tricks today. <laughs> <laughs> say bye. Bye-bye.